We are back in some true stalker. Still in Cordon. We need to collect some artifacts. There was a there was a decent mix of people that really enjoyed this and, and a lot of people that did it. But hey, you know what? That that is okay. I can do both. I can do some of this and, and still be doing my, my U and ISG series, so that's what we'll do. Oh my god, this is the new this is the first video of the new year for me. So hell yeah. Let's go dude. 2024. It's gonna be a good year, I think. I have pretty high hopes for uh, for 2024 for the channel, for everything that we're gonna get get done, dude. Stalker Two is coming like soon. <laughs> like I like I would hope by, by April, by the end of April, we should probably have Stalker Two in our hands, and I cannot wait for that. This is what I mean by uh, some changes to the map. I think this looks crazy. What? What even is this? Uh, Territory Explored Lower Farm. Wait, is this where the... No. That's the farm that I am thinking of. What is this place? Lower Farm with a... Psi Emission symbol next to it. So it emits Psi. So to me that means... It will probably kill me. Uh, let's see if I... Oh... Oh, no, no, no. Okay, I started taking side damage right away. Can I get the thing, though? Oh, my God, it... Oh. Whoa. What? Where am I at? Did it just teleport? Is that a person? Dude, I'm so confused. Okay, let's put this away. Oh, jeez. We're, we just need to go and do our missions, bro, and continue and like get past this weird beginning part of the game. I feel like we're still in like chapter one. Uh, here is a stalker. This is definitely a person. We got Petka Razor here, a stalker chilling by the fire as a stalker <laughs> does. Whoa. Whoa. Sorry about the gun. I forget. Uh, okay, what's up, bro? Uh, what can you tell me that's interesting, dude? I'll tell you what's interesting. It says floating islands. Oh, by the way, I updated the game. It's on like point one point four now. Or point four update. I don't know. Uh, they made a lot of changes to, to perform, uh, not performance, but like bug fixes and crashes, and obviously quality of life because now I can read the text. Okay, we're burning daylight. Let's get the heck out of here. There's so many things that, like, what I do appreciate about this mod is it's making me, it's giving me a lot of like sense of wonder. Like, like I, there's so many things I want to go check out and explore, and that is a very good sign. Um, whether or not it'll reward me with the ability to do. That is a good question, but we'll see. Um, everything is, you know, staged though. If you know, that can be a, a, a bit of a turnoff for some people. Like everything is uh, scripted, I believe. But there's not really a, a life system in this, so you're not gonna have like the super dynamic moments where you know you just see like a pack of dogs fighting a group of duty members and it's funny, and then they, you see their PDA messages. Like that's not really gonna happen here. It's definitely a different experience, but I think it does have something to offer, and I, I do want to continue playing this until I, you know, figure out what that is that it's offering, and uh, or you know, who knows, maybe it, maybe it isn't for me, but uh, it for now I, I think it's something I want to continue uh, trying out. Anomalous tunnel. All right, cool. This is probably where I find some anomalies. Uh, how do I turn my light on? Let's do that. Oh, I put away my thing. Okay, let's pull this out. Um. Hmm. Jeez, I can't. Oh, jeez, there's a thing right there. Looks like I can go this way. Ah. Oh. There you are. Artifacts for the trader. Check for the third. Of okay, so am I done? Am I done here? Can I leave? Good. Okay. <laughs> I wasn't liking that. Uh, there was also a symbol on the map that showed up. What is this? Anom okay, an almost tunnel. I saw like a radiation symbol down in there. I kind of want to go all the way through because that's what leads to a uh, dark valley. Dark, yeah, dark valley. I can't imagine it's going to allow me to do that just yet. Uh, oh, geez, that's far. Okay, now we have to get artifacts from the trader way out there, bro. Come on. That's so far away. Oh, what is this? Hey, Friar, you should go out of here. And what you got from the anomaly. Come on, go uh oh, he wants my anomaly, my artifact. He said, hey, punk, empty everything you found in the anomaly and make it quick. 
Is that your anomaly? The hell do you mean my anomaly? Just doing a routine pocket inspection, dumbass. Uh, sure, take it. You won't get away with it, though. Uh, you'll hurt yourself with a pea shooter like that. Mmm, okay. I mean, dude's just a bandit, ain't he? Sweeper. I kind of want to just take him out, you know? Like, I got, I'm the quickest hand in the West, bud. Let's see if I can, uh, do this without dying. Oh, well, uh, I warned you. If anything, if I were in your shoes, I'd be real careful about where I go around here. If I were you, I'd shut my mouth. <laughs> so I'm not supposed to kill him. Interesting. Very interesting. He is a bandit. And now, okay, so now he's just shit. Well, now I actually don't like this. Maybe that was an opportunity to... I, I'm so bad at linear games, man. It's because I want to explore every option, and so it's so hard for me to just be satisfied with the choices I make in, in games like this. Ah, that may have been a bad idea. Because now the bandits are going to be not cool with me. I feel like so many anomalies. I really want to know what this is all about, but I guess it'll have to wait. Anyways, let's see who's... Oh, this is our homie. Here are the coordinates. Okay. Okay, so he just gave us a little... Just gave us a little side task. Nice. And this is the farm. Very recognizable. Sort of missing some things. There's a body in here. On the mini-map, anyway. Yeah, who... Somebody's dead. Who's this? Is he alone? Yes. Who are you? Dead man. Search corpse. Oh, shit! We just got ourselves a shotgun. That's huge. Uh, and a bunch of shotgun ammo. Uh, and we actually just want all that. So, how do I take all... You guys told me there was a... Oh, yeah, shift to take all. Lovely. So, we got... Let's do... Switch those around. So, primary is the AK secondary. I wish I wouldn't have put away all my shotgun ammo. This thing's gonna be nice. I was wondering when we could uh, get ourselves a shotgun. Why does my movement speed... Whoa, what? My mouse movement is literally slower when I have a shotgun out. Like, this is my movement speed, and then when I put it away, it's... Like, I wasn't moving it faster. Like, that's, that is just the game. I'm not, I'm not a big fan of that. Let's leave, and I guess let's drink some damn vodka. Jesus, I'm just still dying. Let's see, where are we going here? We got a long ways to travel. Uh, I guess we could take the main road. I don't... I don't know. Yeah, it's such a strange change of pace from what I'm used to. So, until... Whoa, another anomaly. So until I get used to it, I uh, apologize if the video uh, flow feels a bit discombobulated. Oh, geez, our stamina. Are we overweight? Uh, no, but we're close. Uh, here's another body. What the heck? Just finding dead people everywhere. What's up? What do you got? Another shotgun? What the fuck? Okay, how about we unload that one and take this one? It's a little bit more repaired. More shotgun ammo, another echo detector, which is good because I accidentally sold mine. We'll take the rest of that. Man, I feel like I should loot everything now at this point. Like, there's so much good stuff. There's another body way over there by the truck. And then this place. Who are these guys? Those are probably bandits. It's usually, uh, usually bandits hanging around this place. It could, I could be wrong though. And you are grave digger. Stop. Wait. So these are these are just loners. What's up? They got exosuits. Freaking Giga Chads. Don't tell me we scared you. Come on over. We don't bite. Nice. Okay. Well, you know, I was just walking by big exo guys walking around the cordon. <laughs> Nothing out of the ordinary. We got back from a an excursion not long ago. This place is good for relaxing and resting up. Gear sure is neat. Where exactly are you returning from? Oh, we just got another mission. Masters from the cordon. Okay. We were at the Chernobyl power plant. Oh, I wish that guy would stop talking. Mm. <laughs> How was the CMPP? Anything interesting there? Nope. <laughs> Best stay clear of that place. All right. Whenever you feel like you come to us and we'll find some decent work for you. Absolutely. Okay, sweet. So uh, these guys are friendly, which is nice. I guess let's take a look at the map because we have a couple of jobs. Um, we have this one. Where is this one at? Okay, this one we can hit on our way back. So... Let's continue with, with this main quest. Wow, look at me. You could never climb a hill this steep in, in Gamma. 
<laughs> All right, what do we got? Oh, this looks like the... Who's that? Okay, there's somebody here. There's somebody dead there. Uh, there's something out there. In a, in a building out here as well. There are just so many unexplored areas. This looks like the thing that's in the... Uh, I forget what it's called, but uh, it's in the Red Forest. Hey, мужик, пошарься тут на предмет артефактов. Не пойму, то ли у меня детектор не пашет, то ли руки мои кривые шалят. All right, Vital Dork wants me to help him find some artifacts. If only a fool would wander into that arsehole of his own free will, or someone who. Oh, that's right. I got it. You work for Sidorovich too. Yep. Oh, you shouldn't have, bro. Oh, what's the matter? Old man may grumble all the time, but he pays the money. He does, but it's pennies, considering how hard it's earned. Have you seen what a mess is going on in the sawmill? These, there's anomalies all over the place. If you call yourself a stalker, go to the zone. What's the problem? Yes, but the old man could pay me extra for working in particularly dangerous places. I hear Beard pays good money for artifacts. We'll spend a couple of weeks here with the boys, buy some gear, and head north. Oh, and Zatin. It's a long way from here. It's not an option to stay here and work for pennies either. I'm ready to take risks to climb anomalies, to carry radioactive stuff, but only if they pay me accordingly. You won't get a decent pay from this old man. That's why we're not going to stay on in Cordon, and neither should you. I was going further north too, by the way. If you get to Zata, maybe you could let me know how it's going. All right, it's a deal. Um, all right, let's find some artifacts. Whoa. Oh, I got it. Wait, what? Uh, okay. All right. Yep. Carry on. Okay. <laughs> we have another job to hit on the way back. To uh, Yorick messaged me that the soldiers that were sent after us died in an anomaly. Maybe they have something useful on them. I should check it out. Okay, so that was from the very, 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 very like beginning, the very first thing you see when you start the game. Was oh, that food? I really need to stop looting stuff like that. I don't need. Okay. What do you got? An AK? We'll take the ammo. Uh, max, please. Yep, take all of that. Is that better condition? Uh, let's see. 71%? 71% It's the same. Okay, let's get out of here. Radiation's crazy. Alright, we're good. Oh my god. Okay. <laughs> so many anomalies. Get me away from this place, dude. Jesus. Alright, so I'm gonna make my way back toward... Corden or uh, rookie village and we'll stop by this side mission to search this military body on the way really wondering what's gonna happen though since I chose to not give that bandit my artifact that I found he kind of made it sound like they're gonna plan some other way to get me probably gonna get ambushed I feel like oh it shows that the okay the body is underneath I think we go left and then search this guy. Okay, he's got nothing. Search you. Hey, a transceiver. Fine military transceiver capable of picking up radio chatter within 30 kilometers. Uh oh. What is this? Uh oh. Oh! I don't think so, bud. Holy shit, I almost died. You see my Oh, I am dead! <laughs> I thought I got them all, dude. Come on. <laughs> that sucks. I was not ready for that. Alright, so that's what happens when uh, you don't give the bandit what he wants. Um, okay, we gotta do this again. Loot the transceiver. Alright. So we got three behind us. And we got this guy. Grenade? What? Holy shit. Uh... Did he just kill himself? I think we're good. What the hell? Pretty sure his grenade just killed him. Okay. Can we... I think we can walk out of here. Uh, we're gonna loot these bandits. Uh, we're gonna take all of his stuff. Nice. What a bunch of losers! 
are so heavy. Oh, I just picked up an MP5, and now I'm too overloaded to move? No. Oh, it's so broken, though. Dude, I want this. How do I, how do I keep this stuff? Let's put it back on the body, and then we'll, we'll just come back for it. We gotta store stuff and then come back for all this loot. Yeah, something's definitely, like, glitched with the shotgun when I pull it out. Like, the AK, the pistol, they don't do it, but the shotgun, like, slows my movement speed? My, like, turn speed? Which is definitely not right. What's up, doggo? Are you chilling? I think they're chilling. Alright, well, that mission's done. And we already took care of Sweeper, the little bandit thief wanted my artifact. We have gotta go get that MP5, because that thing's gonna be pretty nice, I feel like. Sid, I have your stupid artifacts, man. They no, take them. All right, done with the artifact job. He took the bear detector, okay. That sucks. Show me what he scrounged up. Here, that's all I can find. Whoa, he gave me 5,700. Give me, and I gave him three artifacts. That's, that'll do perfectly well. Here, your well-deserved money, fair and square. I guess that wasn't a lot of money. I said, are you out of your mind? This isn't even half of what the artifacts are worth. I almost got wasted for them. And you're giving me nothing for it. Now, now, Axe. Don't get your shorts in a twist. I can't give you any more. At the end of the day, I gave you a good detector. How would you have found the artifacts without it? Find more after this and I'll buy you it. I'll buy it for a good price. By the way, Fnatic wanted to see you outside. He says he's got a dog layer that needs taken care of. And he could use the extra firepower, so hurry on up. Haven't changed a bit, you old fart. <laughs> okay, let's put some stuff away. I don't even know what all we need to sell. I don't need all these guns either, I imagine. Uh, I did get a comment saying that Repairing guns to sell is like not worth it. I need more meds. We have 12 grand. It's pretty good. Uh, let's see about selling some things. Uh, I don't need these flesh eyes. That's worth 300. Fantastic. I don't need both of these. It's worth 100. Um, I might actually buy this gas mask now because this will help out a lot. Confirm trade. We're rolling in the dough. All right, let's buy this mask. I hope that's. Not a waste, we'll Need see. Locker. Okay. Looking lit. <laughs> this mask is like molded to our head. <laughs> so we need to talk to Fnatic. That's the main quest. We need to find a stalker named Mute and we need to visit the CMPP. I don't think either of those things are gonna be easy to do. Oh, we got a stash tree loot. This tree right here is the shit. Perfect place for hiding stuff. Not a single soul is gonna find it. Well, I'm gonna find it. Let's, okay, let's talk to Fnatic, grab that, finish looting the, uh, bandits that we killed earlier. Am I still heavy? Whoa. Whoa. 32 kg? How? What weighs so damn much? That's 3 kg. That's 3 kg. Is that the ammo? No. Ammo's very light. What is weighing me down right now, man? I feel like I'm missing something very obvious. I don't know. Why am I heavy? I don't know. It's weird. Sidorovich told me you're planning to, on dealing with the mutants. Need any help? Wouldn't hurt. Ready to move out? I'm ready. How much of a budget? What budget? We're making sure that the scum doesn't get foot in the village. Sorry, I've got my own plans. Well, you know, I was planning on throwing some equipment and cash from the village reserves. And now we're talking. Okay, listen up. The four of us are planning to shoot down the pseudo dogs. We're sick of them and their attacks on the village. Those things breed like rabbits. They usually hang out somewhere by the vehicle station, but we're not just going to put them down. We need to find their lair and blow it to kingdom come. What's the plan? Wolf hid some dynamite near the local motive. If you leave the village and follow the road to the railway bank, turn right, keep keep going until you see it. That's where you have to look for it. Find dynamite, head to the place we've marked out. While we cover you, shoot down the dogs and place the dynamite in the hole. We'll blow it up. Easier said than done, but we'll manage. Don't be long. Okay. Oh, nice. You can move while on the map. I love it when you can do that. Let's go get our MP5. What's up, doggo? Oh, are they attacking me now? They might be. Oh, that didn't kill you? Oh, jeez. Oh my god. You should be dead. Okay, we got it. Alright, hopefully my guns and everything are still here. No. Dude, what? You're joking me. It's all gone. Bro, what? The bodies despawned. So the military bodies don't despawn, but the bandits do. That's fantastic. Okay, so we lost an MP5. Maybe if I would have left it on the ground, 
that would have been okay. We definitely missed out on the opportunity to get some extra 9 mil. That's so unfortunate, man. Alright, let's go get this dynamite blow up some dogs. That sounds cool. What is this? Oh, there's an energy drink. Oh, and that's a pistol. A Beretta 92. What? Let's go. I barely, I didn't even see that. Uh, 70% condition. This is, this is nice. What the heck? I, I will definitely be using that. Wait, let me check the stats. Uh, 18 damage. This is better. This is better in every way. We're gonna, we're gonna, we're gonna try and use that. Now I really, really wish I would have got that 9 mil ammo off the bodies. Ah, I found it. Take dynamite. There we go. And the mutant layer is further north. I, I really want to go and loot this thing though. But it's covered in anomalies. Like it might it might be kind of difficult. I just I definitely see something lootable right there. Anomalous locomotive discovered. Yeah. Hmm. I already know. If I jump over this fence, bro, I'm gonna have to go all the way around. And I'm not trying to do that. So let's go this way. Go toward the mission. Oh, I thought I was hearing something. Yeah, there's gunshots. They are already... They started without me, man. Hold on, I'm coming. I just have no stamina. Set the charge. Okay, I'm working on it. What's up? Whoa, gamer. Chill. Jeez. Uh, okay, they're ready, it looks like. Where, where do I... Where do I put it? Oh, bro, do I gotta go in this bitch? Hell no. Dude. Where, where do I put the chart? Put dynamite. Okay, I did it. Run! <laughs> okay. That was nice. Phew, that was intense. But we did things quick. I hope this will discourage those beasts from multiplying for a while. Here's some money and an AK, like I promised. Though it needs a repair, battered as it is. And if you try to fire it, it'll literally jam every shot. Where can I fix it? Is there anyone with the know-how? As a technician in the village, Michalik is his name. Ask him. He won't repair it for free, but I believe you two can strike a deal. Got it. Thanks. Headed back to the village. You with us? Um, honestly, yeah, because I do not want to have to run all the way back. Let's go. <laughs> I'm really glad they gave me the option to just travel with those guys. So our next main task is to talk to Technician. We'll go ahead and do that. I don't know if I'll do all the side tasks in this game. I'll do the ones that are interesting to me, but I just I don't think I'm going to do all of them. Uh, let's look at the gun. Whoa! What the fuck? It's purple. <laughs> this is an AK-74 UM. What is there rarities? Is there rare, rare items in this game? What is this? What is this? Fortnite? Come on, man. <laughs> it has an enlarged magazine for 45 rounds and a mount for sights. The gun needs serious repairs. Okay, so this is like, we have to get this thing fixed. I thought it was gonna be like one of these AK-74Us that I have, and I wasn't gonna actually need it, but no, nah, dude, it's purple. Dude, it's purple, which means it's rare. Buddy, I'm more than busy. Come, he always says this. It's me, Fanatic Simi. Says you're the gun fixer here. Could you repair my AK? Later, okay? I told you, I got tons of work right now. Leave it here and I'll fix it later. Do you maybe have some work for me then? While you're busy, I could help out. I don't have any money to pay you for the repair. Actually, you can help me right now. Got a little something that needs taken care of. What's it about? Every night in the lowlands, that's where the radioactive swamp is. I've been seeing these strange hovering lights. It's gotta be artifacts, very rare ones too. I went there at daytime, but didn't find anything. Seems like they only come out at night. So the night has its own, and the night has its own dangers. I'm a technician, not a combatant, and there's been enough mutants around recently. If you can check out the place or retrieve the artifacts, I'll fix your rifle and give you a discount on future orders. What do you say? I'm in. It'll be hard without a rifle, so I don't have any choice. Have a couple of anti-rads for the trip. Don't be long there. Good luck. I'll be back soon. Okay, cool. Uh, wait until nightfall. Nice. Good thing we didn't sleep because it is pretty much about to be nighttime. That actually works out quite well. Yeah, I think these guns are kind of useless. A lot of these are. We have so many Fort 12s. So let's take all these broken ass guns. So I can't sell them because they're too broken. So what we'll do is a little something I call donating to the zone. Let's just drop all of these. There we go. Now there's, everyone gets a pistol if they want it. There you go. Slot up this Beretta. Oh yes. Very nice. I like it. 
We gotta wait till technician finishes repair. We gotta wait till nightfall for this strange glow mission. So, I guess while we're waiting for it to turn nighttime, which should be any minute, we're gonna head toward this tree loot uh, stash. It's not too far, and now we can finally run for a while. So let's go do that. By the time we get this, it should be dark enough to start that mission, and then hopefully we can get that gun. Try and do all that today, dude. Look at that. That is cool. I mean, I know the gr the graphics in this game, right? They they don't look that great, especially if you're used to something like Gamma. It's very, uh, <laughs> dare I say, like these hand models remind me of Arma 2. <laughs> like, they just don't look good. But it's a super old engine that this game is being built off of. So, I mean, with that in mind, like what they have here is pretty nice. And they do have, it has its moments, you know? Like that sky looks pretty cool. Okay, oh geez, okay, yeah, there's dogs everywhere. Hold on, let me go around. This flashlight's not doing me many favors. Let's try and find this damn thing. Where's the stash at? Oh Jesus, oh Jesus Christ. There's so many. <laughs> I am bleeding, hold on. Let's fix the bleed. Okay, do we get them all? I think we got them all. There has to be some kind of... Oh, I... I get it. Oh, okay. <laughs> I get it. But this tree is the shit. It is, it is the tree that I'm searching. How the heck? What? How the heck? Oh no, okay, I got it. Okay. Let's go here. And then up the... Oh my god, I found it. Search. Jeez. Okay, we got a first aid. That's good. Some vinca. It's also good. That took a while. Did it start? Strange glow. Okay, nice. It started. Oh. What the fuck? What the fuck? Your batteries run out. Okay. That's cool. But, like, what the hell just happened to my screen? Use? Okay. There we go. We have new battery. Um, I have no idea what just happened, boys. My whole screen just turned blue, and I didn't like it. We have to go into this pit. It's, uh, it's acting like a poltergeist. I'm not liking that. I think it is a poltergeist, because when I walk slow, it doesn't aggro. Oh, that's a poltergeist. Oh, yes, that is a poltergeist. More than one, actually. Okay. Well, uh, this is going to take a lot of ammo, so let's use the AK, because I have more for that. Oh shit. I, I don't even know if I'm hitting them. They're throwing shit. Oh, that hit me. What? Oh, careful. Jeez. Oh, I'm almost dead. I'm almost dead. Uh, shit. Okay, let's try and just push in there. Oh, fuck you guys. Okay, shotgun did pretty well. Oh, watch the health. Am I good? Oh, no. That one's dead. That one's dead. Let's go. We got him. Oh, my God. Oh, no. <laughs> Dude. I was doing so well, bro. Okay, um, oh shit, where am I at? Oh, dude, I haven't saved in so long. Well, that was a gigantic waste of time now. All right, uh, haven't saved in a while, turns out. Uh, having to wait for missions to start is not a fun mechanic. <laughs> We're at 59, come on. It's almost, I think you only have to wait till midnight. There we go, strange glow anomaly. Let's go do this damn thing. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna save. <laughs> Alright, let's get in there. I'm a stalker vet, bro. I know how to deal with poltergeists, okay? Get me in there. Come here, bitch. Get closer, I dare you. Get closer, please. I'm almost dead. Oh. Uh, these things are so annoying, bro. Alright, the radiation doesn't even matter. I don't even care.
They're so hard to hit. Ow. Dude. Ah. Okay. We got him. Don't run into the anomaly. Get out. We are out. Okay. We're done. Save. <laughs> Jeez. What freaking artifacts were you on about? All I found were poltergeists and three of them. Really? Ah, oh, crap. Yeah, a bunch of crap. I barely took them down. That's right. Well, shit, they had a real glow to them. Yeah, sure. I don't care what was glowing. Fix my AK. <laughs> I'll fix it. I'll fix it. Go do some other stuff in the meantime. I'll let you know when I'm done. Okay. I don't know how long that's actually gonna... Oh, oh it's our boy. Having a little vodka by the fire, okay. Things never change. Have a drink with the, by the fire by Yurok. Okay. Our boy Yurok. Okay, we're doing it. Look who it is. Sit down. Hi. Tell me. Where were you? What's the news? What do you mean, where was I? I was leading these idiots around. Did you forget my trade? Can't say I've got any news. Got myself a new shooter recently. Other than that, it's the same old thing. So I'm pouring. <laughs> Pour it. There we go. Oof, that was a good one. So what's new with you? You still thinking about going to the garbage? Just thinking about all the bandits. Gives me the chills, man. It's chugging along. I'm working for Sid. Dare you to find a bigger cheapskate in the whole zone. And what's wrong with the garbage? I, I don't know why they put the in front of the cord and the garbage. You know what I mean? I'm just going to call it garbage. So what's wrong with garbage? I've been wanting to see new parts of the zone for ages. Just think about it, eh? Oh, I almost forgot. It's a good thing you gave me the tip off on the jarheads. I checked that place out and found a solid radio on a body, just like the one you have. This means we can get in touch even when our PDAs have no signal. The radio will come in handy for sure. I thought those poor fellows were going to be completely strapped for loot. So what are we talking about? New places. What's what's wicked about it? Just a whole bunch of old abandoned buildings. We have enough of those in the out, on the outside. The main difference there, and not a good one, I tell you, is that once you nod off, you're going to take something in the back. Is that what you want? What the fuck? Dude, quit exaggerating. Why don't you come with me? We'll get rich, buy some worthwhile equipment, and make it back to the court. Nah, buddy, thanks. I'm fine right where I am. I'm fed and dressed. I've got money. What else? Sorry, but I'll pass. Let's cut the talking and get drinking. Pour it already. Feeling real sick right about now. I done did it again. Oh, mama, my head. <laughs> okay. And we're out. <laughs> Похож, паленка оказалась. Пойду я прилягу. Окей. I finished the repairs. You can pick up your AK. Hell yes. Mechalic has came in clutch. The AK from the technician. Let's go. First rifle. Not really, but I think it might be better than the one I have. Pretty sure this would be day three. Let's get the AK first. I do want to check this out. Uh, okay, show me how my battle scarred AK is doing. All right, we got it. Received plus ammo. Let's go. Here's your AK, just like new. And to compensate for the trouble with the poltergeist of ammo. Now I'm sure nothing else will enter that anomaly. If you ever need anything else fixed, come by. I've got more free time for that now. All right. That was all he needed. Now he has free time. <laughs> he was just so caught up with those poltergeists. All right, I'll drop by sometime. Okay, sweet. All right, let's look at this. Purple AK. Rare. <laughs> oh, it actually has upgrades. Yeah, so plus 15 magazine size and plus 20 flatness, which I think is just like range. I'm not sure. All right, I need to find tools for basic work or uh, basic tools, perhaps. So flatness is installed. Magazine size is installed. Optical scope mount. Oh, this is our AK. This looks pretty nice. We could add another 15 rounds. A quad stack of magazine. <laughs> That's insane. Tritium inserts for the iron sights. Rubberized butt plate for recoil. Ergonomic grip for handling. Pretty cool. There's actually a lot of upgrades for the guns. I actually kind of like this. The tritium sights would be really nice on something like this. Because I noticed this pistol is... The iron sights are a little bit hard to see. How much is it? So it's two grand for tritium irons. Honestly, I want to do it. It's so... Yeah, let's do it. And then what about armor? I should have probably looked at this first. Uh, we can add armor to our armor. We can add weight carried. 800 for 5kg carry weight. I think that's a huge upgrade. Let's definitely do that. We got ourselves a new AK. Pretty good. That'll do nicely. And now our pistol, once we reload it, has some really nice sights. I, I am digging that. Wait, so what about repairing items? I guess I didn't really look into that. Um, anyway, what do, what do you got? Uh, 
I'd say you performed well, so I hope you won't. I hope I won't regret trusting you to, with this task. I'm all ears. There's a scientist team that's soon arriving at the military checkpoint. I don't know what the hell they're after, but I do know they're about to depart with a military escort to do some field research. What field research? Here we got money, ammo, aid kit, and food. All right. Uh, so we got a mission to go and follow and a uh, group of scientists that are being escorted by military. And what about repairing guns? That, that's something I'm curious about. Talk. Oh, repairs right here. Oh, you can repair it for like not that much money. Okay, let's repair that. Um, let's repair the armor. Everything else is fine. The shotgun I would repair, but it's actually ass. That might do it for episode two. We haven't done... I'm trying to knock out like as many main missions as I can in each of these, but it's a bit of a, it's a slow pace. It is, it's kind of a slow pace to, to like get through everything. Is this free loot? Bro, give me that. I think I'm gonna go ahead and wrap this video up here, boys. This has been the second part of True Stalker. Yeah, if you enjoyed this, be sure to leave a like if you wanna see some more. 2024, it's gonna be a great year, dude. I cannot wait. We're gonna get into so many cool things. Soccer 2 is gonna be coming out. Pioneer should be coming out. Um, and I. I think there were some other games that I was going to put on the channel, but I can't think of them right now. So, yeah, a lot of cool stuff is coming, though, and I really can't wait. I'm so thankful for each and every one of you for being here and supporting me on this journey. Thank you especially to all my Patreons, and uh, I think that about wraps it up. I'll catch you on the next video.